Welcome to Shine Seating and today we are going to see the seating plan for school exam and this seating plan would be called as column row version because you can select how many students you can seat and which class students you can say make them to sit in a single row of a row. First it goes in the hands of admin and he has to choose the hall design from this page and he has to enter the hall numbers here and their respective rows and the respective columns and this will be displayed automatically and after that he has to enter the list of the uh, classes 8a or 8b here there are 19 classes if you want to increase the classes you can do it you can simply contact through this number and then the medium here this template because the medium of instruction it can be anything English or their regional language after filling this detail go to home page then the work of the admin is to enter the student's name click name list entry and come and you can see that the things which you are entered in the first page has been displayed here 8 a and just enter the roll number if you don't have no need of name no need to enter it just enter the roll number I have entered it as 8A boy 1, boy 2, boy 3 and 8A girl 1 so on. And don't forget to enter the selection B for boys and G for girls. It is very important because here you are going to make them to sit the students separately. Boys separate row and girls in the sorry separate column and the girls separate column. Therefore we have given the option of selecting the boys and girls separately and then after entering the first class then go to 8b and enter the details and so on do it for all the classes which you have this is the work of the admin and after admin does this work anyone uh, with, uh, can do the remaining rest of the things that they can create the seating arrangement and take out the printout and even they can take the room wise arrangement if you want attendance sheet we can also do that and you can contact through this number 94983999487. You can just open the seating template which the admin have saved and click exam seating exam seating start here. Enter the school name because it displays in your page if it be so. If you want it, you can enter, but it is very important to enter the date. If you don't enter the date, nothing will work. So date is very important. Enter the day, month and year and enter the exam detail whether half yearly, quarterly or anything. After entering these three details, go to press next or click next. This is the seating page. This is the hall number. Select the hall number first. The numbers which you have entered in the first page will come here. I have selected the hall number one and then you are going to select the row one, row two, row three, row four, row five and we as per the request it is given as row one you can also do it as column one call two this is a row one means this is this row this is first row and row two signifies second this one and this is row three row four row five so actually we call it as a column but for the understanding which the user have requested we have given it as row one we can do anything so i am going to select which whether the boys or girls to be seated in the row one this is the first row so here from this drop down select b for boys and g for girls if there is nothing select nil i am going to select girls so when you select girls this place shows that row one is for girls then i am going to select the first class in a row you can make them make you can allocate two classes so I'm going to allocate first E8 standard A section and I'm going to allocate 10 students. So the row 1 is over. So there is no place for row 2. So don't enter extra additional students in row 1. Now I'm going to enter the second row from the row 1. The second portion. I'm going to select 9th standard A section and I want to know whether how many students are in ninth standard in the right side you have the uh, column for that ninth a girls it is nine day boys when i scroll down i get nine day girls there are 11 students so i am going to 
allocate 10 students so 8th a 10 students is already located so for 8th a boys remaining there are 14 students you can see this in the remaining students it is displaying so the 9 they have to came here if suppose i want to allocate only 5 students 8th a and the it is displaying 5 seats are available so i am going to allocate another 5 students from b section let me check whether b section has boys yes 8 b has 14 boys so i am allocating 5 students out of it sorry 8a girls not boys it's a girls now see 8a girls 5 and 8b girls 5 this is the speciality and the peculiarity of this template you choose your uh, own choice whether you can see it one class in a row or two class in a row and next i'm going to row two i'm selecting for girls 80 10 yes and again there is no space so i am going to the next one so, so there is no place for second class only there are 10 it is showing no space now come to the next one 8b 10 now i am going to do it for boys same 8a if i'm entering the same number of students just copy it and paste yes again boys i think it is displaying minus so i have entered extra students in 8a boys there is there is one extra that's why it is displaying as minus one I hope you can see this. It's displaying as minus one. So I'm going to reduce one boy from eight day. I'm entering it as nine. So now that has gone, it is displaying zero. Again, eight B boys is one additional eight B. I'm entering it as nine. So this is how you will enter the details and the remaining students are in the next now there is one more row that's the last one and let me see here 8c boys are 21 so i am allocating the boys in that hall 8c and let me allocate 10 students yes and again there is a last one let me see 8d boys there are 10 boys select 8d and i'm allocating 10 students there yes so like this this is the whole one when you scroll down see the, the details which i entered here it is also displayed in the lower side it's a cumulative that is 8 a boys 8 a boys 1 to 14 and 8 b boys 1 to 14 8 a girls 1 to 15 it is displaying so totally 14 boys and 15 girls in 8 a it just displays all those things here And when you scroll down, you can select the hull number here and, and in the same way how we did in the previous hull, you can select the boys or girls and then enter the number of students. If you have any doubt, you can just WhatsApp to 9498399487 and you can get any clearance or idea and even you need any additional features that could be added in this particular hall. Now I'm moving to the home page and i need another one room wise arrangement click the room wise arrangement as you enter the seating page this room wise arrangement gets saved already it is saved see in room one for 8a they are seated only in room one girls and boys if you make them to sit in room two that will be displayed here let me try that going back to seating arrangement go to hall two and i'm going to seat 8a Let me check how many boys are there in 8A, remaining boys. 8A boys are 0. So I cannot enter it. 
let me try here I have ended phi and let me allocate phi here so 8a boys are 4 4 are remaining so I'm going to allocate them in this hall 8a 4 yes they have displayed here and it is also in 8a boys 4 now going back to the room wise arrangement see here is displaying room number 2 8a boys 11 to 14 are seated in room number 2 so this is overall now if you want to take printout just press ctrl p or command p if you are using mac and i'm showing the preview you can save as pdf or open in preview and see whether it is right or not yes single page if you enter all the halls totally there are 18 halls and 19 classes if you want to increase you can increase that also the same way you can take the printout of the seating arrangement if you press ctrl p or command p and open in preview it opens all the 18 halls here so this is the hall number one two three four if you enter the details it will be displayed and also if you want to add any additional features you can add and you can contact through 949839487 for still advanced or still most interesting templates in excel and no vba is used only formulas and happy seating with shines excel